Hey everyone, welcome or welcome back to my channel. So this is day four of seven day English learning challenge. And uh, in this video, I'll be doing something similar to what we did in the first video of this series. And my subscriber Anila has suggested me to make the part two of that video. I'll be asking five questions like about yourself, and you need to answer these questions and these are very important questions that you should ask yourself whether you are learning English or not. So yeah, I will be asking these questions to you guys in a bit but let me remind you a few things. First, you need to think about these questions seriously, honestly. Give time, take your 10-20 minutes, even take few days, think about these questions just contemplate and then answer okay uh, you might feel some of the questions are a bit personal but you know you don't have to tell anybody self-reflection is very very important in our life so yes and also do not forget to practice it twice thrice so that you can feel confident because confidence is the key confidence makes a lot of difference that you also no, I think probably. Without further ado, let's just jump into the video and ask you questions. And question number one is, what are the five things that you must do every single day? You know, according to you, what are the five things that is necessary for you to do? You know, that five things. And uh, now question number two is, what has been your life trying to teach you lately? So this is question number two, bit deep question. I feel but you know think about it you'll get the answer definitely and question number third is when do you feel most alive you know what is that one activity or what are the activities that you do and you feel you are truly present in the moment you are enjoying it wholeheartedly you know you need to answer that and uh, next question is next question is related to what I asked before uh, it is what are the lessons or what is that biggest lesson you have learned in past three months you know you need to answer that last question what would be your ideal day look like you need to describe that you know according to you what would be your ideal day like perfect day this is how you want to spend your day so yes these are the questions that i wanted to ask you you need to answer these questions just do not forget to share these answers with me you know if you are comfortable and uh, yes now it's time for me to answer a few of the questions so the answer number one like what are the five things i must do every single day is first is meditation because i am that kind of a person who doesn't share things with like other people you know I don't have a lot of friends you know I'm that shy introvert kind of a person so sometimes it sometimes it gets very very overwhelmed and I feel you know anxious anxiety and all so that's why meditation is something which I must do every single day to keep myself calm composed you know happy and next is exercise slash yoga because yoga has been most beneficial thing in my life i have struggled with pcod a lot and yoga has recovered it all you know i'm living such a good life because of yoga i feel so i'm very grateful to yoga uh, i want to continue it and i want to do it every single day so yes it's number two and number three would be talking to my parents which i do every single day without fail i i talk to my parents like father and mother every single day and next would be any activity which makes me laugh you know any activity which makes me laugh at least five minutes so yes these are the things that i want to do Every single day actually I must do every single day not want to do what lessons life has been giving me is I feel patience which I have actually I am a patient kind of a person still my try uh, still my life is trying to teach me patience I don't know why you know let me give you one example what is happening with me these days the things I desperately want to get you know the things i am really giving my 100 percent to get is i'm feeling that i'm getting it i have almost gotten it and somebody just they just took it 
like snatched it from me and ran away. Like this is the exact feeling I feel these days about the things I am desperately trying to get. Somebody is snatching it from me and like running away. So I think my life is trying to teach me to be more patient. I don't know why. God knows. And what is the lesson that I have learned in past three months is the biggest lesson that I have learned is not all successes are because of hard work and not all failures are because of carelessness. And believe me, I got this lesson and um, I think about it. Like literally, I think about this phrase and I feel very calm. Like, yeah, otherwise I was like, I always used to blame myself for not getting something, for failing something. Uh, these were the answers and uh, please do not forget to share some of your answers with me and yeah, please like, share and subscribe. Okay, bye. I'll meet you guys soon for day five of seven day English learning challenge. And if you have not watched my previous videos of this series, I'll be leaving all in the comment section below and description and somewhere in the i button and screen and everywhere. You can go and watch. Okay, bye.